can the surgeon that you're talking to give you the birth result that you want? I'm board certified plastic surgeon, Dr. Shim Ching, based at home in Hawaii. And I'm going to try to explain to you how to best pick your surgeon for your procedure. There are two things that you need to consider. First of all, when you are looking for a plastic surgeon, you can go through either friends or family that can go on to somebody. And that's a very good way to find somebody that you will be able to work with. Their way is to look online, which either through review sites or websites, or Google search, or through social media. You want to find a surgeon that has the portfolio look or creates patients that whose results that you like because it's likely that if the surgeon has done a nice job of somebody and he's showing that online, it's likely that he can give, give you a similar result. What you need to look at is experience. Along with presenting good results as a surgeon having a long track record of being in a community, working at a certain place, that always helps. You want somebody who has a fair amount of experience in the procedure that you've done. It's useful to ask when the surgeon finished the training, how many years have they practiced, I feel that the ideal amount of uh, years in practice is somewhere between 10 and higher. I think uh, it takes a good solid 10 years to get enough cases and experience to do the best job possible. Uh, it's not to say that some surgeons are very talented and they could do a very good job for, job for you sooner, but as a general rule, I think uh, 10 years or more is a good amount of experience to have. Can the surgeon that you're talking to give you the result that you want? The other thing to consider is the surgeon going to listen to you so he knows what you want because a lot of surgeons sometimes don't listen to a patient and their own desires. And I feel that's a very important part in the constitution process. The goal is really to make the patient happy, to make them feel better about themselves, to give them the feature that they want, to make them look younger. All these things need to be expressed very clearly so that I can address what the patient wants. And I, I feel that's a very important part of the consultation process, and that happens actually before we even do surgery. It's critical to have that plan in place so that, again, there's gonna be the highest chance of happiness for the patient. I hope you enjoyed this video. In our next video, I'm going to be explaining what makes a good plastic surgeon. And I think it's a very important thing. And part of selecting the surgeon is knowing what makes a really good plastic surgeon.